Okay, hello everybody and welcome to making illusion red ball. Uh, actually, I'll start with a new window. Uh, I'm trying now to fill in it with red background. Uh, actually, I will try to make it more darker and fill it again. Okay, let me introduce you. Uh, my three uh, images which I am get from Google or any image search in the internet using the first ball resize it fit it and I'm using grids to center the ball okay I will use the second ball uh, that's the illusion is the last step getting the second ball trying to blend the first ball with the background okay I'm trying to using some blending modes um, and now I, I will mask the second ball think that's nice right now okay start the mask okay I think uh, it needs some tweaking to have the same position okay some resizing and I'll be happy with it. Okay, I think that's nice. Changing some blending modes, yes. Overlay is the best. And now I get an illusion ball. Trying to get the illusion file, resize it, and fit it in center of the ball. and I will using the mask the previous mask and I try to using overlay okay that's nice also I'll duplicate the illusion for two times or three times I don't know but I will reverse the image and opacity it a little bit and now I get a good one duplicate it again and using some blending modes to change it okay I think dark is nice okay I need it more more illusion and I have a little bit pixels here that I would like to eliminate these pixels okay I get it from the masking okay I want to solve this thing so I will go to refine edge that's the most important mask it gives me uh, a great control for my mask and I'm trying now to expand it a little bit okay that's nice but I am also have some pixels here that I should be eliminated, but uh, I can use the size the previous ball and I get it. Okay. Okay. Right now I will start to make uh, the background um, gradient using gradient overlay. 
uh, with the same colors uh, from darker red to white red not white but uh, more lighter it gives me a depth to represent my illusion ball okay using gradient reverse okay and by using some scales okay I think that's nice right now I'm using some blending so I like this I like this one but uh, I need to mask mask it okay I'm just copy the mask but let's eliminate the shadow okay I will duplicate it choose the one I would like okay using the mask and I will paint in the mask with with white uh, sorry with black to eliminate the white and I'll choose a small brush with um, with some eliminating the the white okay 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 that's no problem I'm I'm just need the illusion which is makes me from this blending lighter and that's okay just eliminate this white okay I think that's nice and you can uh, do anything with it uh, adding some masks add some layers to make it uh, more uh, I'm just right now changing the opacity but I think it's now nice uh, using some blendings so I hope you enjoyed and see you in the next lesson bye bye